Can you picture yourself here? <laughs> but what do you want? What's your biggest need? Ugh. Merv is the new spokesperson for Antioch College. Or, yes. Get our masters. Get our masters about graduating class of June. Exactly. <laughs> Long story short, we are currently in Yellow Springs, Ohio. Yes, this is the city that actually Dave Chappelle actually lives in. So this weekend's actually a Dave Chappelle and Friends where he does a bunch of stand up to kind of thank the community for helping him out, showing him support. Not here. Not not this college, no. No, no this is other side. Yeah. City. Yeah. <laughs> Back in 1825, um, 100 families actually founded this city, and basically they wanted to kind of create a utopia of some sort. They wanted to kind of- They always do. I know. Typically happens is they create a utopia and they try to formulate it after somebody, it doesn't work. And then a small sketchy college pops up. <laughs> what, you on this? They see a lot of the families disagree with each other, so they end up splitting, and then- Shocker. Yeah. The reason why they call it Yellow Springs is essentially because of the rich iron in some of the water in this, or in the water. It's basically polluted water. Polluted water. Polluted, water. polluted <laughs> iron water. There's no way to... No so this area is very, uh, can I use hippie? Not non-derogatory? Yeah. If you guys have already seen a little bit, this place is very eccentric. I'll, I'll just say that. Zach, Zach get in a fight. <laughs> well, you really hate this place, huh? I don't. It's just, <laughs> I find it fascinating. It's just very interesting to me. It's just this is like why my parents and stuff, like, our people are like, What's the difference between college and university? And it's like, I feel like this is the difference. Good. There's a book called The Song of Achilles I've been debating on reading, but I have so many books I need to read. I'm like, that's the last thing I need right now. I'll just get a library card and rent it. <laughs> you guys can tell everything here is heavily recycled. Mm -hmm. um, everything is decorated out, as you guys can see. It. Um, there's a bunch of stat like little um, was it statue gardens. Yeah. There's a bunch With of one them. statue in it. <laughs> With one statue. <laughs> He is. Oh, yeah. I you just post yeah. over once in a while, making his views up. Yeah. <laughs> Riot gear, and he's got this big ass gun, <laughs> and he is not like he's not playing around. Yeah. He's even got like sunglasses and face, the whole thing. And I'm just like, oh, fuck, what is happening? <laughs> and I'm kind of afraid at this point that they're gonna arrest the guy that I'm with, and then I'm stuck at this bar with nine other guys that I don't know. <laughs> Oh god, it was awesome though. <laughs> oh, awesome. holy crap. I had a lot of crazy experiences in Jamaica, it was pretty fun. This, I like this, this is cool. There you that go. is awesome, and you will be planting 10 trees. Well, I awesome, in that yes. case, a great cost. Actually, can I, do one, can I do one thing with it real quick? Yeah. I can really try it on, make sure it fits my big head. I just thought it looked cool, didn't realize I was helping the environment. <laughs> nice hat. Thanks, buddy. I thought it was cool, something yeah. unique. It's very breathable, too. I still believe I'll see you again No matter what I got off the ground For something that matters Matters to me But what do you want? What's your biggest need? Oh! Thank you to Trail Town Brewery for wonderful food, wonderful drinks. Okay. Am I supposed to say something? I don't know. I see you haven't set me up yet. <laughs> As you guys can see, this town is very eccentric. We've already been to like a record shop. We've been to a bookstore. <sighs> We've been to some apparel company that Murph had to buy a hat at. I know. She grew up in Brazil. You gotta help her out. <laughs> she doesn't live there now. I know. <laughs> There's one main stretch of road that's just all shops, just 
it's some of the goofiest stuff, goofiest branding I've seen. It's cool, and, uh, unique. Yeah. I love how much these people have kind of taken the history of some of these buildings and made it their own. Yep. You don't see that a whole lot in, in the rest of Ohio, but they've done a good job of it. Kind of made had a more of a green footprint to it. Murph, Murph likes it. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's Murph approved. If you guys like this content, make sure you guys like and subscribe. As always, little Murph. Wasn't as hippie as I thought it was. Sorry, you're upset. I am. <laughs> I expect to see a lot more things.